In this video, I'm going to show you how to print to the Oki data printers from CorelDRAW. First thing you want to do, I have CorelDRAW X8 open. I'm going to go ahead and load in my file. So if I go to the file menu, you want to import that design, whatever design you're wanting to print here. And what I have is I have a PNG file that we created using our custom designer on the Great Dane Graphics website. So this, this soccer image is a normal stock design, and we just added the type using our customizer. So I'm going to go ahead and hit the import button and I'll place it in my image. Now, this particular document is set to letter size or eight and a half by 11 inches. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna reduce my artwork here to fit on that page because the printer that I'm printing to is the Oki C711, which is a letter size printer. So I'm gonna do like that. It fits in there just fine. Now, if I go to the file menu, we wanna print. So I'm gonna come down to print and we'll get this dialog box. So right here where it says printer, you wanna make sure that you have your Oki printer selected, whichever one you're using. Uh, this is the one I'm printing to here. So right next to that, you see this button says preferences. If you click this button, what this is gonna give you, this is the Oki data print driver. So we can use this dialog box to do our settings. So right here, we're gonna paper quality and automatically select the papers. I'm gonna use whatever I have in my tray or in my feeder. Um, we go to Job Options tab. I'm going to click on the Pro Quality or High Quality tab here. You want to make sure that you mirror your print. So when you, if you're going to print it on a t-shirt, it's going to come in as a mirrored version of a transfer for you. And right here where it says Color tab, I'm going to click on it. And I want to make sure I have a color print. But right here at the bottom is where you have your white printer toner on or off. So I want to make sure my white toner is on. So I do that and I hit OK. Now, right now, normally I would say you just hit the print button. So for some reason with this version of Corel, it will not print a mirrored version of this design. It's just going to print the regular design with the white toner, just right reading. So it won't be mirrored. In order to mirror it, we're going to use Corel's version of the mirror button. So we can find that right here in this print dialog box. Just go to pre-press tab here at the top and click on it. And it's right here. You want to make sure that your mirrored checkbox in this area is on if you have any issues. You may be able to just print using the Oki data drivers and have no issues whatsoever because that happens all the time. But for some weird reason, if it's not mirroring, you want to go ahead and do that in order to make it happen. And that's it. So go ahead and hit print and it's going to come out on your machine.